Hi, good evening. Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, Friends. Noemi. How are you? Fine, thanks. Good. How was your day? Same. It's work it. Tired. Work. Work. Tired. Sí, work. Tired. Okay. Good, good, good. What about you, uh, you Yuri? How was your day? Yuri Araceli? Hi. Uh, hi. I, I always tired. Yeah. What time do you finish work? What time do you finish work? I, at, I finish work at 5 p.m. 5 p.m. And what time do you start? What time do you begin? I start at 8 a.m. Okay, good. And where do you work again? What's the name of your company? I work in Distribuidoras Salvadoreña. Okay, Tizal. Oh, they, they, do they distribute? Uh, Tizal. Do they distribute uh, alcohol? No. ¿Qué distribuye Tizal? I don't understand it, No listen. What does Tizal distribute. Es que se escuchó cortado, se está escuchando cortado. Okay. Sorry. Okay, give me a second. Let me make some adjustments. It's on the other side. Yeah, it's right here. ¿Qué distribuye Dizal? Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Maybe you have problem with the connection. Maybe. Okay, Noemi and Arnoldo, can you hear me? Yes, teacher, I hear you. Okay. So maybe it's your connection, Judy. I'm not sure. My inter my internet my internet is bad. Yeah, I think you have connection problems. Maybe. Okay, yeah. welcome back. What's today's day, people? What's today's date? Mm -hmm. Today is Friday. Today is Friday. Yeah, Friday what? <laughs> Friday what? March 18. Uh huh. March 18. What's the year? 2022. Exactly. Very good. It's Friday, March 18, 2022. That is correct. Let's begin. Um, what is a typical weekend in your life? What's a typical weekend in your life? Mm -hmm. ¿Qué les pregunto ahí? Sometimes, sometimes I have to work the Saturday in the morning. Okay. Saturday in all day, 
normally I stay at home or I have to, to go to the market. Okay. What market do you usually visit? Um, usually oh. I visit Selectos. Oh, okay. Supermarket. Supermarket, yes. Okay. Do you ever visit the market? Alguna vez va al mercado? Sorry. Do you ever go to the market? Yes, yes. When I was a child. Oh, not and... anymore. <laughs> um, or only in the Mercadito de Merliot. Okay. Yes. Okay. Is it a good option to buy in Mercadito de Merliot? No. Ah. I, I visit for the food. You visit Mauritas food? Yes. In Mauritas. Hello, hello. In Mercadito de Merliot. Hello, teacher. I went to Mauritas. Yes. Yes, teacher. Can you hear me, class? Yeah. Yes. Francisco, say something. Dig algo, Francisco, to make sure that I hear you. Hello, good evening, teacher. I hear you. No. Um... Hola, hola. Acá? Traté de meter unos speakers, but they didn't work. Okay, mic, speaker, microphone. Kenya, can you say something, or Andrea, or anybody? Yes, T-shirt, your connection is red. I cannot hear anything. Let me check this here. Maybe Same you are system. losing the connection. Can you hear me? I yes. hear you, you teacher. Algo, please. I hear you, teacher. No, I he says good I hear. Yes. Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Very well. Excellent. Yes. Excellent. All right. Very good. Okay. So what's today's date again? It's March. March what? 18. Excellent. Very good. I hear you perfect now. Okay. Do you remember the topics we covered yesterday? Well, Andrea was absent. She was on vacation. Were you on vacation, Andrea? Um, I have a, I was a, a problem, a little problem. Oh, okay, no problem. Okay, so do you remember the topics we covered yesterday, people? The use of until, then, sign, uh -huh. long. Exactly. From. The use of until, then, from, to, those are prepositions. Those are prepositions. Rafael, how is the weather in San Francisco? Hello. <laughs> how is the weather in the Northern really? California area? ¿Cómo está el clima por allá? <laughs> Just say freezing. Freezing, huh? <laughs> San Francisco is a beautiful city. Anyways, mm -hmm. um, so yesterday we were uh, discussing the use of, of prepositions. From, to, uh, until, then, and so on. 
Any questions there? Any questions there? No. Ok, le vamos a dar un par de minutos a los que todavía no se incorporan. Los Teacher, I, I have a question. Yes, I have ask a question me, about the preposition. Yes. Uh, how, how many, or oh, how to pronounce the negative? Uh, for example, um, for example, um, Cuando yo quiero decir, pero es de la clase de cantear. Yeah, yeah, no problem. Sí, por ejemplo, si yo quiero decir este, yo no, no, no debería, no debería ir a, a la, al, al trabajo. Sí. No debería very, estar en, en el trabajo. Okay, very good. Ok, uh -huh. le voy a hacer una pregunta a usted. How do you say, Francisco, usted debería descansar? Ah. Francisco, eh, you eh, be, could be. Eh, you should. You should be. You should rest. You should, you should be, rest. Right. Okay, piense bien. Necesito que todos me pongan atención a lo que le voy a explicar ahorita. You should. Podrían silenciar los micrófonos, compañeros. You should rest. Ahí yo digo, usted debería descansar. Si usted quiere decir, usted hubiera descansado, usted va a decir, you should have rested. Usted hubiera descansado. Entonces, the only difference that you have between general form and models in past, you need to have the model plus have plus past participle. Recuerde que todos los modos they have a specific function. Le dan un significado en específico al, al verbo. Entonces, en el primero puse, you should rest. Usted debería descansar. En el segundo dice, usted hubiera descansar. So, what is the difference? Después de should, I need to put have and then the verb goes in past participle. Okay, what's the model that we use to talk about mandatory things? Excuse me? What is the model that we use to talk about mandatory things? <laughs> Must. 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 Ah, okay, see. Sí. You must. You must study. ¿Qué digo ahí? You must study. Deberías estudiar. Deberías o debes. 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 Debes estudiar. Ahora, si usted le dice a su hijo, a su hermano, Debiste haber estudiado, va a ser lo mismo. You must have studied. You must have studied. Right there. Entonces, de la misma manera que le puse el have a should con el primer ejemplo, Lo mismo voy a hacer con el must. Le voy a poner have. Y nuevamente el verbo llega en pasado participio. Questions or comments? Yes, teacher. Y uh -huh. para negarlo podría decir you, you should be, you yes. should be not rest. You shouldn't have rested. You shouldn't have rested. Usted no, debió, no debió haber descansado. Ah, okay. no you shouldn't have rested. Usted no vio haber descansado. No debió haber descansado. 
no debió haber tenido que estar. Shouldn't have rest. Yeah, shouldn't have rest. Yes, very good. Thank you, thank you. Sure. Teacher. Yes. I have a problem. Yes, ask to me. Task uh, number two, the exercise number four. Uh, what Flutter. exercise are you speaking about? Uh, two. Huh? The, to task two. Yeah, but what page, Carmen? Oh, in the platform, teacher. Oh, in the platform. Okay. Mandem exactamente where you have the problem. Send it to me in a chat. Oh, the WhatsApp. Yeah, send it to my oh. WhatsApp. Okay, thanks. So, mañana yo lo reviso, yo le respondo. Okay. Anybody else? Any other questions or comments, people? Okay, so let's begin. See this here. Give me a second. Okay, right here. Okay, now we go with, we are on page 15, page 15. Today is the 18, 18. All right, all right. Uh, here's the book. Can you see my book? Can you see my book? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Right. Very good. So we have Alan. Yes, teacher. Blanca. Alan, Blanca, <laughs> Okay, so read this segment of a conversation between an HR representative and a new employee. Uh, ¿Quiénes van a estar en esa conversación según lo que acabo de leer? Alan y Blanca. Alan and Blanca, exactly. So, so please pay attention. Okay. What is your social security number? It's 345-632-45-78654. When were you born? I was born on July 1st. Where did you work? I worked in Molsa. What did you do there? I was the evening manager. When did you work there? From 2005 to 2011. Do you have a university diploma? Yes, I do. I have a BBA. Do you have any chronic medical condition? Yes, I do. I have hypertension. Este lo leímos ayer. Do you have any questions or comments? No questions, no comments? Okay, now we go with the application for employment. This is on page 16. Date, position applied for, name, address, phone number, sex, male or female, date of birth, social security number, driver's license, employment history, dates of employment, name of company, address, job title, and duties. 
education, degree obtained, institution, and date. This is going to be your homework for Monday. Esta va a ser su tarea para el día lunes. And this is evaluated. Si el lunes usted no lo tiene listo, se va a quedar sin esta nota. But every week, I have to assign uh, grades. ¿Qué debo de hacer todas las semanas? Colocar las notas. Exactly. Entonces, las notas vienen de lo que usted participa, de lo que usted hace como tarea. Entonces, esta va a ser su tarea number one. And of course, I take into consideration uh, your participation. Su participación la tomo muy, pero muy en cuenta. Practice makes perfect. Questions or comments? Questions or comments, people? No? All right. I'm going to put you to working pairs and you will ask and answer questions related with job interviews. Si usted analiza cada una de las preguntas, vienen en tiempos variados. Algunas las va a tener que responder en simple present, otras va a ser en simple past. Others are going to be present continuous and so on. Give me a second. Let me send the questions to you. Okay, give me a second. Right here. Right here. Okay, can you see the questions in the WhatsApp chat? Can you see the questions in the WhatsApp chat? Yes, teacher. Okay, so let me assign you to working pairs, breakout rooms. How many people are present? No logro ver. 18. 18. 18. 18 is a good number. Very good. So, vamos a hacer nueve parejas. Si tiene preguntas, ¿cómo responder? Una pregunta en particular, raise your hand and I'll come visit you. Create. Or if you don't understand the question, o si no logra entender la pregunta, De igual manera, consulte. And move to here and let's go.
Maricela, can you hear me? I'm sorry. We point in job interviews. Is it import, important to ask questions in interviews? Pero aquí, como aquí solo la de las entrevistas, bueno, habría uh -huh. que, bueno, yo quick, si no sé qué será, pero, pero sí se comprende, ¿verdad? Preparo, entonces, eh, I dress properly, prepare my curriculum. Uh -huh. Ok. Y eh, me asesor, quiero ver sería. Se le sete, sí. Sete. Da vez. Sete. Candidate, no. The best candidate. The are necessary to select the best. Eh, para mí sería como que eh, prepararme o, o, o estudiar o revisar mis, mis, mis apuntes eh, para poder responder bien. Pienso que sería como algo así. Which question, Francisco? Eh, in the in the number two, number two. Let me check. Number what do you 
before a job interview. Ok, what do you do before a job interview? Generalmente, si le dicen, mire, mañana a las 2 de la tarde usted va a ir a una entrevista de X lugar. ¿Qué mm. generalmente haría usted? In general terms. Yeah, estar, estar antes. Ok. Be on time. Ok. Be on time is good. Ok. All right. Good. Thank you. Good. Va, va a quedar algo así como lo que le dije. Estar en un minuto. Ajá. Estar Dilo. antes, sí, es cierto. Vaya, está bueno. Import. They are important to know. To know the. To know the applicant's skills. Applicant skills. Ajá. Ok. Sí, pero... A tiempo, ¿no? <risa> okay. Hello, hello. <risa> How are Teacher. you? you? Sí. Yes. Y si queremos yeah. decir, vaya, este, tuve dos entrevistas. Uh -huh. Sería, I have had. No, I had two interviews. I, I have. Tuve, yeah. Because when you say tuve, that's simple past. I had two porque, interviews. Porque, pues, no, no es más bien dicho. I was have. No, I had. El have, verbo I tener buying buying a simple past. Mm. Simple past. Yes. Uh. Any other questions or comments? Mm, the question is. Eh? Huh? <laughs> ¿Qué piensas en de un entrevista de trabajo? Creo que significa. What no, number? No. What number? Number three. Number three. Ah, what experience number... do you have of job interviews? ¿Qué experiencia tiene en entrevistas de trabajo? Creo que era la uno, teacher. Sí, la uno. Ajá. Uh -huh. Oh, ¿qué piensa usted yeah. de las entrevistas de trabajo? Mm. De las... Like, what is your opinion? What is your opinion? Got it? Got it. Got it. Okay, very good. Let me visit one more. <laughs> In my case, no. I have nervous. No. I am nervous. It's normal to be nervous in a job interview. It's oh. normal. Yes, we are yes. talking about the a question. A. I say, I say to Ruben that I I could be nervous, but I don't look nervous. Good, very good. And, and I that's believe a... that that is a strong point because it the is. people. Don can see that you are nervous and then you project, you project the confidence. Exactly. And, and that's a good strategy. Like in the inside, you're nervous, but you don't show it. People don't detect that you're nervous. That's good. That's really good. Let me visit another classroom. Okay. Okay, sure. In my case, I always nine. get nervous.
Faltan varios por regresar. One, two, three, only three people. Okay, do you guys have any questions about the exercise you were doing? Nos faltaron unas teacher, por okay. el tiempo. Yes, ya las vamos a, a discutir todos acá juntos. Let me see this here. Okay. ¿A partir de cuál número les faltó? A mí del 8. Ok. En adelante. El ten. Una compañera del TEN. Del grupo que estábamos. Ok. Ok. Question 7. What difficult questions have you had? In an interview, ¿qué preguntas difíciles le pueden hacer en una entrevista? Who wants to answer number seven? What difficult questions? Uh -huh. okay. Question about something I have not experienced. Okay, right. Something where you don't have experience, right. And what is the proper, <coughs> excuse me, what is the proper answer for that question? So imagine that they ask Francisco, Francisco, can you use advanced Excel? Francisco says no, but what is the right form to answer? Le hacen una pregunta sobre, Francisco, do you have a heavy driver's license? Tiene licencia pesada. No, no tengo, pero, ¿qué puedo decir? What can I say? Puedo sacarlo. I'm a fast learner. Okay, I'm a fast learner. You can teach me. I can get it. Usted puede decir, sí sé manejar, pero nunca me he preocupado en sacar una licencia. You know? Like Francisco, Francisco has a motorcycle, but he doesn't have a license. This Francisco, this Francisco, Francisco Marroquín, not Francisco Neemir. Do, do you have a driver's license, uh, Francisco? For motorcycle? Yes. Good. Many people like Francisco Marroquín, they have a motorcycle, but they don't have a license. Pero usted es de los, de, los, de los ejemplos que hay que seguir. Ok, very good. Ilegal, teacher. Yeah, it's illegal. It's illegal. Legally, the police officer, they can confiscate your motorcycle. They can. Le pueden quitar la moto. Ok, question number eight. What are your strong points in job wow. interviews? ¿Cuáles son sus puntos fuertes en... Uh, in entrevista de trabajo, what are your strengths? ¿Cuáles son sus fortalezas en una entrevista de trabajo? Anybody? Uh -huh. uh, I can uh, make budget and financial statement. Financial statements, very good. Are you an accountant, Noemi? Are you an accountant? Yes, I, I am. Good. I am accountant. Very good. Nice. Y mire, cuando uno sabe el oficio, uno llega con autoridad. Mire, yo le puedo hacer esto, 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 esto y todo lo demás. Very good. Anybody else? ¿Cuáles son sus fortalezas con las que llegaría a una entrevista de trabajo? Demostrar la capacidad. Que ha tenido experiencia de otra empresa. Right. Show the capacity from previous experiences. Yes. Yes. Okay. Anybody else? Alguien más? Professional list. Uh huh. Anybody else? Okay. 
Question nine, what are your weak points in job interviews? ¿Cuáles son sus debilidades en una entrevista? Anybody? Nerviosismo. Ok, Pensa. you're nervous. Alguien I que nos... I can speak a lot. You can speak a lot. <laughs> speak a lot. Yes. Okay. Maybe, maybe I can speak something that I don't have to say. Right. So you speak more than necessary. Maybe, yes. <laughs> that is a problem. Okay. Yep. Here because it's in English, the class. Right. If not, I, I speak more. <laughs> okay. All right. Good. Good. All right. So, alguien que nos dé consejos de cómo hacer con el nerviosismo en una entrevista de trabajo. Tranquilly. You mean take it easy? Paciente. Y portali. What is it? Y... During during test. Good. Yes, Moises. Good. During test. Okay. You have It's... during test. <laughs> you have two. Can you please repeat? You have to drink. No, you have to drink tea. You have to drink tea. Tea. Uh -huh. Okay. All right. All right. And the last question: Is it necessary? Is it important to make questions in a job interview? Como candidato. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, it is very important to know the the person. Okay. Okay, and if you're the, the candidate, but if you're the candidate, can you ask questions too? Yes. Yes, you yes. can. Yes. Yes, you can. You can ask about schedule. You can ask about salary. You can ask about your responsibilities. Sure, you can make questions. You can make questions. Thank you. All right. Anybody else wants to add something or has any questions about this last exercise? Teacher, I can hear you. I can't. Sorry, I muted myself. Can you hear me now? Okay, thank you. So I'm gonna take attendance right now. When uh, when you hear your name, please say present. Okay, Alex Martinez. Present teacher. Very good, Alex has perfect attendance the first week, congratulations. Francisco Godinez. Francisco, Francisco. Hello. <laughs> okay, thank you. You have perfect attendance too, congratulations. Tell me, Gomez. Tell me. Tell me, tell me. Tell me. Okay, she's absent. Um, Kenya Ruiz. Kenya, Kenya. Present. Very good. Congratulations. You have perfect attendance too. Thank you. Juan Delgado. 
Present teacher. Okay, very good. Uh, William Perez. William Perez. William, William. Okay, he's absent so far. Susana Jimenez. Susana, Susana. Okay, she's absent. Jose Correa. Jose Correa. Thank you, Jose. You have perfect attendance too. Congratulations. Judy Cuellar. Judy Cuellar. Judy Cuellar. Present, teacher. Thank you. Present. Yes, thank you. Uh, Carlos Avendaño. Judy, do you have perfect attendance? Do you have perfect attendance, Judy? Okay, Carlos Avendaño, are you here? No, he's absent. Okay, Elsa Merino. Elsa, Elsa. Okay, she's absent. Noemi Vasquez. Noemi Vasquez. I'm here, teacher. Thank you, you have perfect attendance too. Congratulations. Thank you. Okay. Rosalie said the pass. You're not here, are you? No. Uh, Ruben Campos. Present, teacher. Thank you. You have perfect attendance too. Helen Barraza. <laughs> Helen, Helen. Thank you. Hey, she's up. <laughs> Moises Rodriguez. Hello. I am here. Teacher. Thank you. You have perfect attendance too. Maricela Velasquez. Maricela. Maricela. Okay. Patricia's absent. Rafael Barrientos. Present teacher. Thank you. Iris Cañas. Present. Thank you. Reina Martinez. Present teacher. Thank you. Juan Ricardo Alvarén. Present teacher. Very good. You have perfect attendance too. Thank you. Carmen Calderon. Present teacher. Very good. Andrea Vasquez. I'm here. Very good. And Ana Mercedes Amaya. Ana Mercedes. Ana Mercedes. Okay, she's up. All right. Uh, Questions about the last exercise, people? No. All right, let's continue with this. What is your homework for Monday, people? What is your homework for Monday? Page, page number 16. Exactly, page 16. Entonces, todos cuando vengan el lunes, le van a tomar una a uh, una imagen al, a la página esa ya llena con su información. Write questions or comments. 
Right now, we're going to work with groups of five. Groups of five. Vamos a trabajar en grupos de cinco. Cada uno va a agarrar uno de los numerales. So Carmen, for example, she will be number one. Reina will be number two. Andrea will be number three. William will be number four. And I will be number five. That's just an example. That's just an example. Solo va a leer y va a hacer un pequeño resumen sobre lo que usted leyó. Una vez usted lea y ya sepa cuál es lo que le va a tocar, lo lee y después cuando yo le diga, se lo va a explicar a su, a su grupo. Is it clear? Entonces va a trabajar con cuatro personas más, incluyendo usted, van a ser cinco. Cada uno va a leer uno de los numerales y ahí mismo se lo va a, a explicar al resto de su grupo. Are the instructions clear? Explain in Spanish, in English. Well, if you can do it in English, that would be perfect. But if you want to translate, you can translate too. Si lo quiere traducir, puede hacerlo también. Okay, are the, sure. Are the instructions okay. clear, people? Are the instructions yes, clear? Yes, teacher. Thank okay, you. Okay, very good. Un grupo va a quedar de tres. Give me a second. Uh, Saturday and Sunday. Why, Mati? Okay, two, four, two, four. Teacher would be uh, the same. Send this patient to the WhatsApp. Uh, what do you mean? Como? Uh, what, what was the photo? For Monday, yes. For Monday's no. homework, yes. Yep. No. So I send the, the screen the, the, in the chat. Uh, mo Monday's ah, homework, oh, okay. yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank so, you. group one, five people. Group two, five people. Group three, five people. And group four has only three people. So, group number four will do only the first three. So, lo van a hacer los primeros tres. Is it clear? Estamos bien lo que vamos a hacer? All right, let's go. Yes, teacher. Good.
Any questions, people? For the moment, no. Okay, good. No question. Okay, thank you. Competente. We create los productos que creamos en Nox, Norso. Son técnicamente complicados. Sí. Yo, Tú no necesitas. Hay uno más. Ya, ya, ya lo. No, ya, ya lo dijimos los cinco. Sí. Ahí estuvo, ¿verdad? No, es que solo somos cuatro. Ah, solo somos cuatro. Sí, sí como uno más, pero el teacher era. Ah. Any <risa> questions? Any comments? Falta Kenia. Sí, es que yo vi a Kenia, ¿eh? Ajá. ¿Qué se hizo que no veo aquí? Ah, no, no sí, está es que Kenia. estaba Kenia. ¿Verdad que sí? Está, sí. Eh, es que no ella había tenido una. Ok, thank you. You're welcome. Entonces, sí, hacemos el último. Ah, sí, ok. Sí, el último, entonces. Okay. Picure, si se pronuncia, un tipo cure. And doing the right thing. I think that is pontificating. And doing the right thing.
Juan Ricardo, how you doing? Can you hear me, Juan? Yes, sir. How are you today? I'm so tired. I'm just arriving at home. Really? Around four minutes, yeah. Yeah. Where do you work again, Juan? Um, I work at CSL Comalapa. This is the... Oh. Yeah, is the Navy, Navy base. Right. Okay. Okay. And what do you do there? Um, I, I have to do a lot of different things, um, because, um, the name of, of I my, imagine, I imagine that you practice your English very frequent. Yeah, we have contact with gringos. <laughs> the yeah. Whole day. Yeah. 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 That's I good. Take, I take um, calls, international calls. Um, I don't know. We have, we practice <coughs> the, the language there. Okay. Every single day. Yeah. All right. That's good. So you get real practice. Yeah. Because um, I talk with some of them, and I I used to tell them that sometimes it's a little bit difficult to understand what they are saying because they don't articulate when they talk when they speak. Right. Right. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and good. that's one of the things that I do really hate. <laughs> Yeah, but you're in yeah. the right process, you know, like, because it, it's a process, you know, like, in practice makes perfect. Yeah, I know. Okay. All I right, know. so let me, let me ask, Delmi Gomez, are you here? Delmi? No. Uh, William Perez, are you here? William, 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 okay. Susana Jimenez, are you here? Okay. Uh, Carlos Avendaño, are you here? Okay. Elsa Merino, are you here? Helen Barraza, are you here? Maricela Velasquez, are you here? No. Okay. What about? Rosa Cottage. Okay. What, what's your name again? Rosa Cottage. La clase. Okay. Okay, I got it. I got it. And mm -hmm. Ana Mercedes de Amaya, are you here? No? Mm -hmm. Okay. So uh, I was talking with, who was I speaking with right now? Who was I speaking with? The person that works in Comalapa, what's your name again? Ricardo, Juan Ricardo. Juan Ricardo. No, Juan Ricardo. Alvarenga. Yeah. Okay. All right. I got you. I got you. Okay. A any questions about the reading activity, people? Were you able to explain what you read and what you understood? Pudieron explicar lo que leyeron y lo que entendieron. No necesariamente explicarlo, pero traducirlo. Like, did you understand the content? Yes, of, teacher. Of what you yes. Yes, yes, teacher. Yes, Excellent. Yes, Excellent. Teacher. Very good. Very good. All right. So, um, see this here. Now we're going to do the last uh, pair work activity. 
I'm going to send you a link. It's a video. It's an animated video. Rafael, hola, no escucho. Seré solo yo. Can everybody hear me? Yes. yes. I can okay. hear you. Okay. Can All hear right. You. All right. Let me see this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Rafael, I think it's only you. Okay, so I'm going to send you a link. The video is like uh, four minutes. Let me see this here. So this is what you will do. They will mention, I think, 14 questions. Give me a second. Okay, go here, right now. Okay, I just sent you a link to the, to the WhatsApp chat. There are 16 questions with 16 answers. Your mission right now, it's only to copy the questions, not the answers. Because when you go to a job interview, they ask you something and what Kenya will answer is different than Noemi. What Moises will answer is different than Juan Ricardo. So copy only the questions. Got it? So right now, copy the questions, okay. watch the video, copy the questions, and I'll tell you what you will do next. Go ahead, please. Okay, thank you. Got it. Good. Okay, teacher. Good, good.
Have you guys finished writing the questions? No, teacher. Not yet, okay. Go ahead. We're almost finished. We're almost finished. A couple of more minutes.
Any questions or comments about uh, the questions you are writing right now? Questions? Or no, teacher. Okay. Now I need to know who's going to stay uh, tonight for a couple of minutes. Volunteer, volunteer to stay tonight. Volunteer or victim? Mm -hmm. Alex Martinez, have you stayed yet? Alex, Alex, can you hear me? Uh -huh. Check this here. I don't think he's here. <coughs> Ruben, can you hear me, Ruben? <coughs> Hello, teacher. Can you stay tonight? Oh, sí, no puedo, teacher. Uh -huh. ¿Quién puede quedarse? Who can stay tonight? Somebody has to stay. Andrea Vasquez, can you stay? Okay, teacher. Okay. All right, people. So we're going to continue with this activity on Monday. Don't forget that page 16 is your homework. So everybody has a nice weekend. Everybody can disconnect except Andrea. Thank you, teacher. Have a nice weekend. Enjoy and rest. Nice, nice weekend. Thank, Thank you, teacher. You. Good Thank night. Thank you. Have a good night. Thank you. Good night. Bye-bye. Good, good, good night. Good night. Good night. night. Monday. See you on Monday. Yes. Yo lo bendiga a todos y a todas. Good. Very good. Thank you. Same to you. All right. All right. <laughs> No puedo salir. Don't worry, I'll help you, Juan Ricardo. And where is this one? Right here. Okay, how are you, Andrea? Fine. Good. And good. you? Um, a little bit tired, you know, it's Friday, so my body is like, Francisco, go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Do you work Saturdays, uh, Andrea? Yes, all day. Oh, okay. Where do you work again? Uh, Distribuidor Salvador. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. Andrea, do you have any questions or comments about the uh, about the topics we have been working on? Um, solo tal vez un review del, del, del tema de ayer. ¿Cuál tema vimos ayer? Permítame. Déjeme veo la. Ok. Is this your screen? Prepositions, creo. Yes, prepositions, exactly. So what we do, is we were these uh, bold letters. From two, four, until then, sing, sing long. Mm -hmm. From indicates when the action began. Two indicates when the action finished. Four, indicates a specific amount of time for five years, for 10 weeks, for one month. Until means hasta. hasta. Then, entonces, or después, is it has double uh, meaning. Sings means desde, and it also indicates when the action began. 
sims. And the last one is long, that makes reference to uh, very much time. Any questions or comments? Um, no, creo que está claro, teacher. Okay. If, mm -hmm. it, where did you study English before, Andrea? Yes, I, I have, no, 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 sing. Um, I guess five months. Five months. And, and where did you study before? Donde estudio antes, Inglés. Here. Oh, really? Yes. Okay. Pero imagino que traes... Uh, Fundaciones fuertes de bachillerato o de la universidad. De bachillerato. Okay. Where did you study your high school? In uh, Fabio Castillo. Fabio Castillo. Where is this? Ilopango. Oh, okay. All right. Well, you're in Santa Tecla right now, right? No, in, in... San Jacinto. No, teacher, in San Bartolo. Oh, okay. Okay, good. Del good. otro lado del mundo. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yo viví en Ilupango también. I, I lived in Colonia Santa Lucia for a couple of years. Ah. Yeah. The, Así que, uh -huh. the yeah, school from, at, uh, in front of the alcaldía. Okay, right, right, yes. Okay, good, good, nice. Any other questions or comments, Andrea? No, teacher. No. Okay, so thank you very much for your time, por las veces que se conecta, su participación y todo. It's very, it's highly appreciated. So thank you very much. Eh, teacher, y una pregunta. La tarea del lunes, solo la vamos a contestar y la foto le vamos a mostrar. Exactly. Sí, solamente eso. Se la enviaríamos al chat. Yeah, al WhatsApp chat, pero a mi número. No al chat, sino que a mi número. Okay, al personal. Exactly, exactly. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right, anything else, Sandra? Nothing. Okay, so thank you very much. Enjoy your weekend. Thank you. <laughs> okay, have a good night. Bye. Good bye night, bye. teacher. Bye.